Okay, ne next troubleshooting this GUA. Uh, one of the most common things that you find when you come down to these furnaces. This is what you hear when you come down to the furnace. This blower has started, but the burner doesn't come on. So I'm going to take a look at the ignition control. Okay, now if I look at this control, and in this case I'm looking close at this thing, I can see I got a flashing light. Okay. And in this case I can look at the control, it says if it's got a flashing light, it's off of flame failure, so there's been no flame. If it's a steady light, the controls fail. But okay, I got a blinky light. So that means this thing is tried three times, failed to light, and hard locked out. Hard lock out means it ain't going to start again. Okay, so I don't need to do any more troubleshoot on any of the other uh, switches in the line. I know that um, there's been a flame failure problem. Okay, let's see if we can figure out why. Okay, I've recycled this thing. The light's gone out, so it's going to give another uh, trial for ignition. Now I'm going to clamp my meter right there. Now my meter is in amps. And it's not going to read anything until I hear a click from that valve or the control. You got about 30 seconds. Okay, you hear that? I got no amp drop. Okay. That means almost certainly I have a hot surface igniter fed. Okay, now I pulled the hot surface igniter out. And if you look real close, you'll see that little white spot. That means the hot surface igniter is open, and that is your problem. I'll show you where it's at. Okay, to have a hot a look at the hot surface igniter, you got to pull this cover off. I've already pulled the screws off. Look inside there. Here's where your hot surface igniter goes in. I'll have to pull this shield, and you can take a look at where it is. And you can double check it with an ohm meter or whatever it takes. Uh, or if you can find the white spot like I saw, uh, then you know what's happened. Okay, I've got the hot surface igniter, or I've got the cover off there and the shield off. And there is the hot surface igniter. And it's just failed. You can double check by trying to fire this thing off with the cover off. Now I'm going to caution you on that. If you try to fire this thing off the cover off with the gas on, you're going to get a face full of fire if the thing lights up. So shut the gas off before you try this. But you can double check everything uh, by uh, firing it up and let it run through a cycle and see if you get the glow out of the hot stick igniter. Uh, and that's it for uh, troubleshoot up to the hot surface igniter.